Okay, so I went to Kroger today and I wanted to show you what I got that's vegan. So first we have this pack of Trutillas and what makes them vegan is that they don't have any lard. Pretty cool. Um, then we have Hampton Creek's Just Ranch and Just Mayo. Have some soy milk, um, some silk dairy-free yogurt. And this is the meat that Robert really likes. Uh, the Morning Star chicken strips and the Morning Star um, steak strips. And for anybody wanting to eat less meat, Guardian is really good. They have chicken, fish, crab, pork. Um, they have tons of stuff, and they're really tasty, in my opinion. Um, then we have the Light Life uh, ham slices. Sometimes we have sandwiches, so this is what we go to. They're honestly, like, my favorite. Um, they, uh, I only got it, really, because it was on sale. Um, it's good for, like, nacho cheese. Once you mix it in with um, some milk, it's okay. Um, my favorite, though, is the child cheese from um, Field Roast. It's really creamy, in my opinion. It's not gritty, and the taste is not super weird. Um, okay, and then we have the Field Roast uh, sausages. I haven't had this flavor, but I've had other ones, and I like the texture, and I like the taste. So, you know, they're on sale. And then this is... Um, the Light Life uh, hot dogs, they're okay. Um, not my favorite, but definitely amongst the best, I feel. And then um, we have this soy chorizo. Um, it's like a, around a dollar, so it's really good for the amount, like the amount that you get. So I use it for um, tofu scramble. This is, um, I don't know if you all know, but this is, the best way to explain it is like tofu, but harder. So this is a good substitute for like a protein or something. I don't know. Um, I'm not sure how I'm going to use this, but I got it. <laughs> but it's available. It's, if you don't want to eat like the processed, you know, highly processed meats, you could use tempeh and season it whatever way you want. And, you know, it tastes pretty good. Um... Butter, I have the Earth Balance butter, and right there it says vegan. It's essentially just oils um, compared to having um, like a cream or milk. And then my favorite sour cream is the Tofuti sour cream. And it's really, really good. Um, it's not as sour as your typical sour cream, but it'll do. And then my favorite kombucha. Oh my god, this is so good. For anybody wanting to try kombucha, um, yeah, this is so good because it's not as fizzy as others and it's a little bit sweeter than most. <laughs> I feel so, not overly sweet, but it's, I feel like it's perfect. It's honestly so good. And then, okay, so I've been using other kinds of soaps, but... I haven't tried this one, um, but I wanted to include it in this haul because, um, so it's not tested on animals and it doesn't have any animal ingredients because it's super unnecessary for us to use products that test on animals. It's uh, pretty cruel and unnecessary when you can just get something that doesn't <laughs> include all the cruelty, right? So. That's essentially, all, I mean, I could show you fruits and vegetables, but that's pretty standard for, you know, anybody. So this is mostly the things that are processed that sometimes I buy, sometimes I don't, some things I, you know, I keep handy. And they last me a long time because we don't eat them all the time. But yeah, just wanted to show y'all what's available at Kroger. You don't have to go to Whole Foods <laughs> if you don't want to. Um, so, yeah, I guess let me know if y'all find any of these things at your Kroger, or if you've seen them, maybe you've been curious to try them. Um, like these bags, they're only, like, around $4, and, um, they have four servings. Sorry, I can't. Yes, they have four servings. Most of them have four servings, so that's a dollar a serving of whatever meat that you're gonna have, so... Yeah. All right. Well, that's it. Bye.